channel Miss I'll say it's World Gamers YouTube channel video. Uh, I'm Chris and today I'm going to be, sorry the top of my head is just cut off, um, today I'm going to be doing a unboxing the box. So um, what does that mean? So basically I've got a box here, a parcel from one Mr. Sam Page who you'll recognise from this channel who's probably not been on it for like three years. Um, I have purchased from him his famous Hunter Rock Army, um, which has been seen in SPG magazines, been seen in loads of tournaments, loads of different videos, um, ignore the cat over there. Um, so I bought his Hunter Rock Army off him for a very nice price, so thank you for that. Um, but I don't know exactly what I bought off of him, so I'm literally going to dig it all out and show you what I've got for my new basically going to be in my tournament army next year. I've got a few bits coming from Kieran Street as well. Um, a few unpainted bits, so I'm either going to try and match it or redo it or, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. But I'm literally just going to ravel through it and see what goodies he's given me. So straight away on the top I can see it's taken a bit of travel damage, but that's no bother. It's like a nice shaman conversion there. Oh, very nice. That could be a captain now because I know before he used to ally it with uh, Mordor back in the last edition when you can do uh, any allies you wanted, there's no yellow, uh, green or red. But yeah, he used to take um, the Mordor Shaman to go with his Hunter Rocks because obviously their defence four are quite weak, so Shaman would help with that then. But I could turn that into a captain quite easily, I think. So there's that one, that's pretty cool. Uh, I can already see some more Hunter Rocks on Warg, just a basic one there. Very nicely painted. Yeah, and there's one, he's giving a whip to that one. What a madman. Oh, whip to that one. There's, there's another one there. Another basic one there. Another one there. That's what we are. There's the shaman four. Plus another one five. What's this? Oh. No, I had already seen this. Uh, just briefly, but there's a Yasneg in here. But he's taken a bit of damage on the back, which I'm not too bothered because I might convert him. Because um, Kieran's sending me a brand new one, um, so this is an, uh, a massive deal that uh, he is he has broken there. So I might turn him into one that's been killed by Azog when his price of failure rule comes into play. Maybe that could be quite cool. Uh, basic old school wag there that always comes in handy because the fell wags are expensive to get. Yeah, but there is a, an actual fell bark there as well. Another rider who's got a broken weapon, but I have tons of spares on my sprues from when I used to have an hunter rock army, um, which is stupid because I'm buying a different one instead now. That was years ago I had a, my own hunter rock army. Another wild walk. I've never used it, so I painted it up really nicely, sold it as like a commission. Um, and yeah, now I want to play hunter rocks again. There's another guy with a with a whip. Um, what else we got in here? We got a, another fell wild. So that makes two basic wilds, three wild wilds, another wild wild, another fell wild. Oh. I won't disclose how much I paid for this, but it was a very good price. Another hunter orc there. Uh, what we got oh, he has neck on foot. He is wonderfully painted. I really like it. I'm gonna definitely be using this one as opposed to one Nazi because that's better, better than the thing I'll be able to do. Um, another fell wag. Another fell wag. So that's a whole box of six there. Oh, plus more. Plus more. Good God, Sam. I don't feel bad about how much I actually paid for this. Yeah? Uh, another fell wag there. Check out all the cow stuff first. Really cool hunter rock. There, the cool pose. He's positioned these all really well. So I know there's quite a lot of versatility with the um, with the hunter rocks and what you can do with them. And he's done these all really nicely. You can tell a lot of care was taken over doing these. Um, little fell wag, little wild wag. Do there. The two-handed pick. He could be handy. Uh, who else we got? We got another. Fell wag. Get off. Get off. You get off. 
is really trapped under there. Help me get under. Uh, more cav. Basic wards. Basic wards. That's full six basic wards. Very nice. Uh, I think that's all the cav. There's a cav base there, but that's the Yasmex one. Oh, here we go. Oh, convert a, a banner there. Look at that. That is a. Um, there's a, a Gondor banner, the um, uh, Knight of Minas Tirith uh, comes at the end of the lance, and that fits in really nicely on there for that, that banner bearer. Um, the white orc there, oh he's putting one, ah that was a uh, Nazog base by the looks of it. I recognise those feet. So he's made a, a captain, he's painted in white, so that's very cool. He's lost his other weapon, that's fine, I'm sure I could find something for him to hold. And he's converted these really well, some with pick and a sword, usually they become a double sword or a sword and a bow, or just two handed picks, but he's done quite a lot on these, there's a lot of versatility in this army. Um, it's like on this one would normally have been a bow, but he's given it a cool sword pose. Um, that one there. Lots of different skin colours as well. Bowman. There's a few, I'm picking out all the painted ones at the moment, there's a few unpainted as well, which is cool, so I can do those how I like. Uh, Miller Bowman, what are you doing, animal? Why now? Um, some more there, so how many hunter rocks are we up to? I'll try and separate the bows that we normally do to a little bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 plus the captain version plus the banner. So this will make 11, 12. Oh, that's not page one, so I'll say 11. Another dude there. Oh, he's got a war horn. Look at that. That's definitely going to come in handy for Ox, that plus one courage. That's very cool. Um, so that makes 12 basic ones. 13, 14. Jesus, goes on forever in here. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, and these are all only the painted ones as well, uh, 29, 30, 31, 32, 2, 33, 34, all the painted ones, 35, these not painted, those 35 basic hunter rocks, and then plus one to be converted with a banner, plus one to be converted with a war horn, that's 37, and then a 38th well, was one that's converted to be a captain. Uh, I'm going to stand these all up and then do a panning shot at the end because um, this is nuts so there's plenty enough for dismounts as well which is ooh, the one thing that made me sell my hunter rock army before was because I had a couple of war bands of the foot guys a war band of the mounted guys but obviously to dismount them you then need to buy the a pack of fell wags for the wag to be dismounted and a pack of more of the foot guys so they can be dismounted and the price of it just was it, it racked up quickly, so I only got some bits for it. And I never picked up the heroes, which are now out of production, which lately have been uh, uh, repackaged and will be re released. But I've already um, bought some off of Kieran, um, who also sold them to me for a nice make rate. Look at that one there. Oh, I don't know where that fell went. There it is. There it is. Get in there. And then we've got a few. Oh, I found Yasnik's uh, Lance arm. Oh, that wraps all the way around the back. Oh, how strange. Ah, so that's all fixed in one go. Nice. It looked like there's several pieces, pieces missing off of it. It's literally just one big back piece. It goes all together. Maybe you can 
see that? Oh, that's the bit that came off. And then that just sits there. Come around. Sits there. So he's, so he's actually alright. I need to glue those two bits together. And then I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 dudes who are just undercoated, unpainted in there as well. So that is crazy um, <clears throat> how much we've got there from him. I'm going to go behind the camera and tilt it down and just show you exactly what's here. There we go. Move it over a bit. So we've got all these foot guys down here, the, the lovely banner conversion just on this guy here. Um, Absolutely wonderfully done. Uh, got the captain who he's done in white there. I might. <coughs> so there's in one of the kits, I think it's the troll kit, it comes with uh, heads hanging, uh, decapitated heads um, with the hair at the top and look like he's holding them. That'll be cool to add on to the to the captain. Or I'll give him a bow because the hunter or captains are quite good at shooting, especially with the army bonus. There's the war horn. Uh, fella there, if it'll focus, probably not, no that's fine, and then yeah, uh, how many riders was it, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 riders, plus the shaman I could just use as a normal one, that is absolutely incredible, so thank you Sam for that, and yeah, that is the new Hunter Rock army I now own, and that will be my project for the next few months, ready for next year, um, thank you very much for watching, that was unboxing the mystery box, um, don't forget to comment, like, share and subscribe, there'll be some, uh, there'll be a link to subscribe up on the top left and there'll be some more videos to check out down the bottom, so click on those links.